Okay. So today we're going to continue on with our Dino Crisis. I already forgot what happened yesterday. I am not very good with memory. That is very loud. <laughs> that is extremely loud. Let me lower that a little bit for me. But yeah, um, what did we do last night? We did... Huh. You know, let's just go in and find out what we did. Let me check my inventory and stuff like that and see, see what's up. Because I don't exactly remember because my brain brain not think too well okay i have to go to that door over there right right and what items do i have i have the key and a key card um i think i am good i just have to like remember how to get there so i can go out through ba 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 Let's see. Gonna go here, there, there, and then that goes outside. Is it this door? Let's find out. I'll find out by walking and seeing if this is the right place, the right hallway. Yes, this is the right hallway. This hallway I can take this way because I think that's where the vent is. Yeah, this way. I go through here and then I go straight, I think. Right? I go straight unless that door is locked. I'm actually not sure if that door is locked. Let's find out. This door. It should be open, I think. Unless there was lasers here, I... Okay, we good. Yeah, we good. Uh, I just go straight to here and then... Yeah. Okay, everything seems to be pretty much fine so far. Uh, no dinosaurs yet. I mean, we just started, so I don't expect to see a dinosaur that fast. But I think this is the door I have to go. Backyard of the facility. Yeah. We're on the right track. Pretty sure we are, at least. And we have to go to the, to the fenced off area over here. From what I remember, now that we have this key, you have a used the B1 backup generator room key. Yep. Okay, fantastic. Now I can go in here, pick this up. I don't know what this is, but I mean, I'll take it. Inventory full. There isn't enough space to hold the an aid. Okay. Um, an aid. That is the anesthetic. Anesthetic. So, huh? I don't think I can do much right now to really have that anesthetic with me. I can combine a resuscitation with this to get like super, super darts or something, I guess. Which I don't think I really want to do because resuscitations are, <laughs> are, they're pretty handy. I'd rather, I'd rather have them than not have them. That's a very awkward way to go down the ladder. Okay, so what is down here? I don't actually know what's down here, so let's look around real quick. There's a battery charger there. There's a generator here. The thing is red, blue, green, white. Red, blue, green, white. Okay. I am missing one <laughs> of the things. Huh. Yeah, one of them is missing. The red is missing. Am I supposed to, like, bring a... A red thing here, I wonder. Yeah, I do. Okay, uh, well, I don't have that right now. So this is pretty much impossible right now. So that is unfortunate. The battery is set in the charger. Will you remove the battery? Yes. I have acquired the battery. Okay. Now I can put it in. And it's going to be red, blue, green, white. Red, blue, green, white. Uh, start a battery red. There we go. Red, blue, green, white. So we're gonna... 
Well, that, that's fine, I guess. Red, I will put red. All the way to the left. Red. Blue. And this last movement should make everything work. Red, blue, green, white. There we go. Now we just do this. I honestly don't even know what this does. I just did it because I did it upstairs. So I'm doing it downstairs now. And hopefully this is just fine and normal. And nothing bad will happen, right? Nothing bad at all. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yes, sir. I will be on my way back to that area. Do not worry, friends. Uh, I mean, I know I know how to get there already, so it shouldn't be that bad. <laughs> the only bad thing might be dinosaurs on the way, but it should be okay, probably. It can't be that bad. What does this say? I wonder. Does this say anything? No. Okay, I go fuck myself. All right. Damn, look at that booty. It's so square. <laughs> so I have to get to that room. I wonder if I should equip my shoddy with some anesthetic darts. Would that be worth while fuck I didn't mean to would that be worthwhile huh I could just avoid him I am really good at games so avoid <laughs> all right let me not say anything about that sort of stuff I'm gonna get it's gonna come bite me in the ass so let me let let's just not say anything about how good I am at video games when in most cases it's a lie. <laughs> oh my god. Well that that happened. <laughs> I that's not something I expected at all. <laughs> Okay, um, well, I just got attacked by a dinosaur. Nothing out of the ordinary, I suppose. Just par for the course, I suppose. A. Eh? <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> I'm not actually sure how to, like, function those danger scenes. I just mash the buttons until something, something happens, and I guess it works half the time. And when I... Am I in the right place? I am right. This is the safe room that's next to the, the vent. So now I go... Yeah. Okay, we're good. We are A-OK. -okay. So I go through here. I wonder if you actually take damage when that happens. Like in those danger moments. I mean, I got bit, obviously. I'm fucking getting mauled alive. But I wonder if it actually, like goes into account your health because it's not something you can like avoid I'm gonna assume I'm not bleeding or anything so I'm gonna say that it's probably just regular melee damage or some shit no idea this is the room that has the medical stuff right yeah. I already took everything right Right, so this is the room that I have to go into with uh, my boy. I forgot his name. <laughs> What's the emergency? Gail just told me he saw someone on the underground monitor. Mm hmm. Underground. You fly by pretty quick, but well, I'm sure I saw something. Hmm. Rick, open the shutter to the underground area. Yes, sir. What is it? Someone's calling me. Hmm. Yeah, or it might be Tom. He infiltrated this facility posing as one of the researchers. Yeah. Pinpoint the signal. Oh, I guess we can it's try. Coming from outside of the building. 
to the east of the rear entrance we came in from. Okay. Look, we'll the east is down. Is the in the it could be the dock. So I'm gonna guess the what are you this guy's gonna go. He's asking for our help. We don't leave our own behind. And what if it's a trap? Could be. To come and rescue you? Don't bother. I'm willing to take that risk. Remember our mission. We're not here to babysit. Hmm. That's your way of operating. Not mine. Damn. This guy don't give a shit. Alright. You have your access to the underground, Gale. To mm -hmm. get moving. You handle your things your way. I'll handle my things my way. Uh, then what do I do? What do I do as Regina? Hmm. Okay. So, what will you? Oh, I can pick. What will you do? Choosing the idea you believe in, Gail's idea. Search for clues to find Doctor Kirk. Rick's idea. Rescue your comrade immediately. You know. Around here. Sometimes you gotta. You gotta go off the beaten path and help out your friends. So, yes, we're gonna help my boy. They need help, so I'm coming to help. I'm sorry that I, I'm not gonna go underground yet. At least I want to help my buddy that is in danger. He he could be dead already, for all I know. And I'm just gonna be wasting my time, and that's that's okay as long as I can um, confirm what's going on. Huh? What was that? Why is the music like that? <laughs> Why does the music do that? <laughs> did, did something gonna happen? <laughs> oh Christ! Well, at least with going over to help this person, it's gonna. Um, make us backtrack which sucks but oh well gotta be worse i guess god stop that <laughs> why does it have to make that noise right <laughs> it's like something bad's happening but nothing's happening it's just it's just me walking but it has to go <laughs> and i feel like there's a a monster or something around the corner god damn it Oh, that's not around the corner, but it sure is in here. <laughs> see if I can avoid it. Okay. We're okay. Nothing to worry about. So, we came in through here. So, we have to go... Just straight. Straight here. Straight here, there's a door that we can go into. This is pretty much the place at the start where that dinosaur was chasing me, so that is a uh, not a comfortable thing to uh, to keep in mind, because there was a, a raptor. Large size elevator passageway. Oh, well, I guess we're gonna see what happens. You're taking a little nap, mate. Oh, you're taking little naps. <laughs> oh no. I am in trouble. I am in a lot of trouble. Oh, they're just say my friend just kind of walked past here. <laughs> oh no. We are in a lot of trouble right now. Um. 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 um, um, um let's see. Let's see what to do. What to do. What to do. See, I gotta think fast. Tank controls aren't the easiest thing to to move around in so um um i can maybe hug the bottom wall oh fuck it. let's see what happens oh didn't i just heal did i cancel it did i cancel my heal or something i healed didn't i huh did I cancel it by accident? I probably did. Knowing my big brain. 
Oh, I think because I used this one. Will temporarily recover your health. Maybe that's why. That's the one I use instead of using... Like, the actual medkits. <laughs> right. I use this. Medpack S++. You know, that makes more sense now that I'm thinking about it. Okay, let's try to avoid these guys again. Are they going to be on the floor or are they going to be standing up already? Oh. That's a little bit better for me. Yeah, I'll take the resuscitation. Oh, fucker. Oh, okay. We're fine. Okay, so I'm glad they weren't, like, right at the door. Which is good. What is that? Oh! Birds! Dinosaur birds. What are they doing here? Okay, okay, that just happened. Well, that is not something I expected to happen. He's dumbass dinosaur bird. <laughs> I gotta get my gun back. Yeah. Jesus. And I am dying apparently, so I need to heal. Yeah. Will temporarily recover your health. I don't know what this means. Does that mean it's just going to be like a heal for a short amount of time instead of like an actual heal? I assume that's what it means. Hey, thanks for the posture check, Waddle Daisy. I appreciate it. <laughs> I was hunching a little, so thanks for that. Hello, by the way. How are you, mate? Hopefully you're doing fantastic on this... What is today? Tuesday night or Wednesday afternoon for you, I think. But I do have to heal now. Okay. Get out of the way, stupid bird. Can I just avoid it? Oh my god, bird. Okay, I can avoid I can avoid the bird. Wednesday Avo. Ah so it is Wednesday. That's good. Wednesday is a good day. I wish I knew what these guys were saying, but they talk very low. Hmm. How are you though? Uh huh. Hey, what up, Savai? Hello, hello. How are you, mate? Mm hmm. He gave me something, but I don't know what he's saying. I wish I knew what he was saying. But the. Like I said last time. Are you crazy? Are you out of your mind? Hey, thanks for the. The sub with Prime Gaming, Waddle Daisy. I really appreciate it. What the fuck is this game? This is called Dino Crisis for the PlayStation 1 that came out in 1999. Made by Capcom. Um, so it's a game that is kind of like Resident Evil, as you can tell. And instead of zombies, I get to fight dinosaurs. And dinosaurs scare the shit out of me. <laughs> compared to, to zombies because dinosaurs are fast and they'll kick your ass also an old game yeah Tetris is also an old game an old game for boomers I mean I'm, I'm not gonna play Tetris right now but at some point yeah we can play so I I'll be down I ain't got no problem I mean you're gonna beat our ass but <laughs> it's, it's fine yeah, this is pretty much one of Alb's autobiographies because it includes dinosaurs. These are his ancestors. Okay? <laughs> but yeah, uh, hello Alb. How are you, bro? Um, how about... One second. Oh, typing is hard. But yeah, uh... This game isn't really long, so don't expect this to be like weeks and weeks of Dino Crisis. It's it's like a six hour game or some shit. Uh, what did I get? I got a key, right? I got the the the, the, the L D D K key. Where do I take that again? Um, 
I don't have a place where I can take that key to now. Where is the longsword build? Um, soon. I'll I'll have it soon. For right now, I'm just building the the um, the bow gun build right now. So you're gonna have to wait a little bit till we get to longsword. Sorry. Soon though, I will make sure to grant your wishes of having longsword. But not, not really. <laughs> There's no swords in this game. At least not that I can tell. I wonder if that dinosaur is still flying around out here. Let's go find out. Large size elevator. Oh, it definitely is here. Hello, bird. Oh, there's two of them now. Oh, even better. I love birds. Especially birds that are the size of a fucking truck. All right. Well, we don't have to go through here. That's okay. We can just get out. Uh, <laughs> Jesus. Oops. Didn't mean to bonk the microphone right now. I still don't know why it makes that sound. It freaks me out, and I feel like there's going to be like an enemy, but there's no enemy. There's literally nothing. And it freaks me out, and I hate it. Stop making that sound music. Oh my god, birds. God damn it! Uh, I don't like you. I don't like you. Oh my god, they knock my ass on the floor real easy. Okay. Bye bye, birds. I'm just gonna go in here. Oh, her running was legit. You going to the bus stop? <laughs> like, hey! Stop! Stop the bus! And your little stubby ass legs makes it even harder for you. You gotta run at four times the normal human speed to even uh catch up to the bus. <laughs> well, hopefully you did what you had to do. Um, the card seems to be used when transporting chemical materials. Okay. Chemical. Ma oh, there's buttons and they're colorful. Wait, the effect. Um, caution, when operating the power supply pipe, by activating the main motor, you can supply power to the big elevator. In case you accidentally lower the wrong pipe while trying to supply the power, you can return the pipe to the original position by pressing the button on the same computer. Terminal. <laughs> Is, am I supposed to just figure out the buttons? Oh, okay. I, I can do that. Enough to power a spaceship. You mean like a small spaceship, right? Like a small, small spaceship. Which button will you press? I will press this one. Is that good? Green. Okay, green seems to be good. What about... Green here. Nothing happened. Okay, I'll go fuck myself. Nothing ha Why did I press the same button again? Red. Yeah, you're right. A small spaceship for a small person. You're not wrong about that. A very small person. But there's nothing wrong with that. Being small doesn't... Okay, it has disadvantages. But <laughs> it's not that bad. Uh, Which one did I press? I pressed this one, right? No, I don't know which one I pressed on this side. It was this one? Yes, okay. So, on this one, I press red. Let's try green. Well, gr green definitely did something. Green, let's try red here. Nope, that is not a good one. Let's try blue. That's not a good one either. Um, take that shit off. Maybe I have to remove the green before I do something with the red. So I can lower it properly? Because it hit? Eh, maybe? JK. <laughs> That's not the right thing. Have you eaten dinner yet? Uh... Daisy, Waddle Daisy, some good shit today. 
maybe. Okay, maybe I put the wrong pipes. I think I put the wrong pipes. I feel like I did. I can keep trying pipes until something happens, I suppose. Yes, I put the wrong pipes. That is unfortunate. Let's try the blue one here. Wow. Can I... Can I move them? <laughs> is there... Is there some sort of hint that I missed? Am I just supposed to figure it out? I'm gonna assume I just have to figure it out. Fantastic. I love figuring stuff out. It's my favorite thing to do in video games. Just figure it out, idiot. Let's get that shit off of there. So let me go in the order. Did I, I think I did this. Yeah. Let's put... What's this one? Oh, shit. I have green left. Okay. You kind of figure it out just by looking at it? Wow. Alright, well let me... Let's see. Let's put this side first. Okay, that connects to something, that's for sure. Uh, let's see. Do these connect? Of course not, why would they? Nothing ha- oh fuck, dude. Uh, blue, get that off of there. Red, do you connect? No, of course not. Fuck. Let's try... What did I try before this red one? I tried... Green, right? Or was it blue? I think I tried blue. Oh, that's not it. Well, I mean, it could be it, but I just don't have, like... Maybe the correct pipe in the first one over there. Let's try red again. Here. That looked like it was gonna work, and then it didn't work. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna summon Mario, so I need green pipes at all times. I forgot. Thanks for reminding me who I'm summoning. I appreciate it. <laughs> yeah, there's a Mario Easter egg in this game. If you get the pipes in the correct order, Mario will come out of the pipe and, and greet you. Trust me, I've played this game a total of one time, one time being this time that I'm playing it right now. This is my first time. But pretend like I've played it more. And that's gonna make it more believable. That one seems like it's too far. Pointing that way. I could be wrong. I can try this and see what happens. Oh, definitely not the right one. Definitely not. La 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 la. So let's try blue here. Definitely not blue there. Swap them. <laughs> I don't know what you mean by swap them. This is here. This this is fine. Um Wait, well, well I'm not I'm not even sure if I'm supposed to connect blues with blues, greens with greens and reds with reds. I don't know if that's the thing I'm supposed to do. That that's the thing. I put red here before. Let's try green. That just goes straight. And that's this one. So let's try to connect green to this one. See what happens. Okay, that goes all the way. Okay. Beautiful. That one works. So green's used. Let's try red here. 
This is the second. Does this use red here? Definitely not. That would not fit it either way. So here, let's try blue. No, that's too high. Hold on. What if I put red here? Almost. It almost looks like it's going to work there, but no. Okay. Uh, which one did I put down right now? This one? Yeah, this one. I'm going to assume that green one is probably not correct, though. I could be completely wrong about that one. Like, going straight, I don't feel like it's the right the right way actually hold on blue wrong wrong this started hurting to watch you know you can just not <laughs> i'm just kind of experimenting you know no, are they, wait, are they the same? This one and the other one? Yeah. You want me to put red here on the second pipe? The one I literally just tried not long ago. Because, I mean, there's delay. It, it, you're going you're to have to compensate for delay, Al. That one bonks there. You're going to have to think ahead. Like three seconds. Uh, that one doesn't go there. You want to you want me to keep the red but take greens away. But I like the greens. I like them there. That's my favorite one. I want to keep the greens. Oh fine, you Mr. No Fun. I could have probably figured it out eventually, but I just kind of like pressing buttons. <laughs> Pressing buttons is fun. That one doesn't go there. Not at all. Doo -doo 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 -doo. That doesn't go there at all either. You say this one's red. Well, I can tell you right now, you're apparently incorrect. Because they don't link up at all. This one's the middle. I mean, I already tried the middle. And you said upper right are red, but I did it and they don't link. So, uh, yeah. Because this is bottom left, of course, and then this is top, um, upper right. Yeah, move the... This is bottom left. Is, is this what you mean? Did I... Oh, which one the... F Where the hell did I move red then? Oh, I pressed the middle one. I thought I moved it somewhere else. I thought I had pressed the bottom left. Reading chat and looking at that makes my head confused. I should just stop reading chats half the time whenever I'm trying to figure shit out. Hmm... Just to make it more of an accomplishment for me when there's puzzles like this. Because I, I figure it out event. I mean, I'm going to figure it out eventually. Is this going to bonk? No. Eh, come on. Tank controllers. Oh, 
Wait, which one am I missing? The first? Uh, yeah. And what does this do? <laughs> I wonder. Is it going to open a door? Does it turn on something? Am I going to die? Is there going to be dinosaurs jumping at me? Well, it did something, that's for sure. Uh, but what did it do? Uh, nah, nah, nah. Uh -huh. Oh, probably for the um, elevator, yeah. Yeah, elevator. Where the big dinosaurs are at that are flying at me and trying to kick my ass. Right. <laughs> I don't like how the 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 ladder climbing animation is out of place like it's not centered correctly it's a little centered to the right or not centered to the right it's more to the right than centered why is there a little cuts in here now oh not again <laughs> god's fucking birds leave me alone Jesus. Did it really try to do fucking like kabikaze and kill itself while killing me? Now that is not something I expected from dinosaurs. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I guess you learn something every day. Um, There was no other door over there, right? Not that I can see. No, there was nothing else. Okay. Okay, sir, I activated the elevator. He's taking care of Tom's wounds. Okay. I guess I'll just go outside then. Yeah, life... He, that, that wasn't like... Just using life points. That was pretty much just losing everything. That wasn't just a little bit of life points, that's all the life points. That's how we use the elevator. I, w I will use the elevator. Okay. I press the button. Okay, I, I press the button. You should get back to Rick and Tom. Oh, okay. Maybe it's like powering up or something, like it's charging. Yeah, cause self-destruct button used to cause, uh, ties. It's bullshit. Hmm. Okay, I guess we're going outside. Something to- something bad's gonna happen. Something really bad. Like, I feel like T-Rex man's gonna show up and Fuck shit up. You saw the beast, right? Yeah. Tyrannodon, wasn't it? Hmm. It meant you saw that it was a real dinosaur. Real dinosaurs? It's not fake. It's Did real. Tell you? This is just like that movie. This is like that movie, Jurassic Park. Where the dinosaurs were real. Because the scientists brought dinosaurs back. Wow. I'm gonna have to fight a boss or something here, aren't I? Something really, really weird is gonna come out of that door. There's gonna be like a stegosaurus, but uh, actually aren't those herbivores now that I'm thinking about it? I'm not too sure. I'm gonna say yes, they are herbivores. So, I'm not even sure what kind of dinosaurs are in the game other than raptors, T-Rex, and flying boys. Regina. We have to hurry. Tom's hmm. not going to last much longer. Oh, he'll be fine. By moving these containers. We just keep an eye on Tom. Hmm. I wonder if I can squash them by accident with the containers. That'd be unfortunate for them. If my dumbass crushes them. If only I could see. Maybe up here I can see just fine. Like what way 
I can go if I move the containers because I, I mean I can't see right now not at all okay is this a door or is this a oh no this is a, a show okay let's see is it gonna allow me to see if I press this control card is required to operate the crane uh don't I have that yes I do well you operate the crane yes uh where is the start what the fuck does this mean card select what am I playing Yu-Gi-Oh now you talk about Yu-Gi-Oh and then Yu-Gi-Oh starts happening <laughs> play your starting hand do you want to mulligan I do not wish to mulligan no uh, let's see what that does. Okay, it moves it. Oh, there's blood and shit over there. Okay, good to know. So, we're gonna move left, hook, down, release. In that order. I guess I should have gone up. Left, up to. Uh, hook down re no uh how do I take that off no <laughs> okay I do that that hook down release is this good I think up to is too much I, th I thought it would move a little bit less than that so let's see let's not what if, what if I just do hook it's gonna go right here okay well I don't think I need this one so let's release that okay so I can move okay this one is just here I would have to move have have a down to two so I just have to move two of them so when it's the hook is right here it's actually looking at the bottom one it's not over the second one in the middle it's at the bottom so I'm actually starting down here that's why I couldn't go down or whatever before okay that makes sense so I can move I don't have an up one, so I would have to move up two. Or I can maybe move right two. That would put me one, two right here. Up two right here, right here. Yeah. Left two, up two, right here, and hook. That's too much. <laughs> that was too much movement okay I I'm done okay so two up is gonna make me go all the way up okay where's my cursor ba -da -da -bom -bom. I can't go down right no it doesn't let me go down right no okay down is pretty much I'm all the way down as of right now so I can do left one if only there was an up one but there is no up one there is only left one and up two because I want to get that one uh, that's on the left middle and this one goes too high. What happens if I'm holding something? I want to see. Is it going to let me input again? Okay, it brings it all the way down here. Can I release this here? No, I have to put it on an empty slot. Okay. So I could put it something like here. Okay. 
And then does it stay in that spot or does it reset? It resets all the way. Okay. So I can do left. No, I have to do... Wait up. There's no left two, right? There's only left one. Yeah, yeah left one. Okay. So I can do right two. That take me there. Down. I can't go down if I'm all the way down here. Up two. No. Up two. That's an empty slot. That's the one I did before. And I picked up that box. So you cannot stack boxes. I mean, it would... It makes sense if you can stack boxes, right? I mean, it's uh, these boxes are meant to be stacked, aren't they? That should make sense to me. I mean, I I mean, I'd stack them. I can move up two, down one, and hook. Now that that's me, move this one out of the way. Um, this, this, release. I wonder if there's more than one solution for this. Cause okay, now I can just move that center one that I moved there before. I think. Um, uh, fucking cards. Let me pick you. One, two, one, one. I can do one, two, one, one, hook. There we go. And I think they should clear up the path. Once I pick this shit up. And then I can, I can just put this one in the center. And uh, release it. And I think that's okay. Should be okay, unless it's asking me to do something completely different. But to me, that seems correct, because the, the path is open. If they expect me to move everything from the wall over, then uh, fuck you. But we're good. Well, Concentrate on the mission. You can rest here. Right. Yes, sir. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Got it. I'll do my best against the dinosaurs. Alba's relatives shall go down. His brethren, dinosaur. So, am I supposed to go over here? Uh, there's nothing shiny, so I guess I do go over here. Right here, there is. Uh, is that an arm? <laughs> Oh, that's... Oh, it's not an arm. It's a torso. It's just a normal tor torso. The dead man has a memo. Will you read the memo? Sure. Today's to do. Prepare the DDKs needed to enter the laboratory area. Tomorrow I have to go to the computer room to do the maintenance on Dr. Kirk's computer. But I think I left the DDK at the large size elevator control room. When I went there yesterday to do the elevator maintenance, I'll have to check it out later today. As for the other DDK, I think the rookie guy Tom, who was recently assigned to the laboratory area, has it. I'll have to borrow it from him. I have no idea how to that jerk approached Kirk, but he seems to have gained his complete trust. It's weird how nobody knows his past history. Okay, well, I have the things, right? The L's. I got these L's. Yeah, it's literally the opposite of an arm. It's just, it's just a torso. An aesthetic dart. Okay. Uh, does this open? Yes, this opens. Hallway for carrying in materials. Okay, I do have to go here. Oh, there's a fucking raptor, mate. <laughs> Chew on this, asshole. Oh. Okay. <laughs> so I'm gonna assume that is another room. 
Oh, they're probably fine. Honestly. They're probably okay. A tough looking wire netting. It's been smashed by something with incredible strength. I wonder if I can go into the other room. Into the whatever the other room was. I don't know what it is. To this room over here. The door has been on. Where does this take me? Hallway for carrying material. Where is this? Where am I? Okay, I came in, but I, I wish I had like a little... A little reticle. Well, not a reticle, like a little arrow or something so I know which one I am. It just kind of puts you in and hopes that you can figure it out. What is this? Nothing, probably. Okay, I can open that. Can I go in this door? The door has been unlocked, but where does this take me? Where do you take me? Is this... Does it take me here into this room? No. I guess we'll find out. Backup generator room B1. Oh, I know where I am now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is where the battery was. Okay. Yeah, yeah, we're good. I know where I am now. If I go up the ladder here, it takes me to the, um, the door that was locked before. Right. Okay. So... That's this door. Before... Here. So, on the other side of this... Whatever this is, this, uh, laser. There should be two doors? We push the switch? Sure. Or am I tripping? Oh, it's he- Oh, why does this happen to me? <laughs> why is- Why? Why is there a dinosaur there? You jerk. That didn't happen before. Why does it have to happen now? It doesn't seem like a lost health, so I think we're fine. I hope we're fine. Is there any enemies around here? Any dinosaurs? Will you press the switch? Nothing happened. Well, no. The switch is off. Or the light's red, I should say. So nothing's gonna happen. Medical room hallway. So this is where the dudes went. Ah, for Christ's sake. Oh, what are these babies doing? Baby dinosaurs are probably going to be more dangerous than normal dinosaurs. Fuck me. Oh, there's so many of them. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> oh my god. I can't see. <laughs> Shoot the babies. The baby dinosaurs. Ba the baby dinosaurs, okay? No, you don't have to take it weird. The wire nading over the ventilation shift has been torn and removed. Can I reattach it? I don't want to deal with baby dinosaurs. They seem like they're gonna be a nuisance. Oh, hey, nice. A med pack. Why is there a med cap? med pack inside a dinosaur. Blood is seeping from the hundreds of small cuts. Oh yes. Is there another dinosaur over here that I can't see because there's blood or the camera was all funny? Okay. Medical room. Is this where they were right now? Where you saw that cutscene with the, the the raptor? Most definitely. It's not your fault, Rick. You tried your best. I'll be in the control room. Hmm. All right. Be careful, brother. Ah, <gasps> uh, well, the guy's fucking dead. 
What a waste of time that was. We came here to help you and then you just die. Come on, brother. Oh, hey, ID card. I needed that yesterday. Now I got it. It's a memo that seems to have been addressed to the doctor. On duty, will you read the memo? Sure. Dr. Sherwood, the ID card on the desk belongs to one of my patients. Please hand it to Colonel Clay when he shows up. He told me that he was going to hold a meeting in the strategy room on the first floor to make preparations for tonight's experiment. Please make sure to hand the card to him since one is required to enter the strategy room. Okay. Door! <laughs> Door difficult. Can I take his gun? It's Tom's corpse. He has been savagely slashed. So is that a no? Oh, oh well. Recovery aid. Cannot take that. I wanted his gun though. Small size. I need a small size key to open this emergency case. I don't have a, a key for that, sadly. Scam of the palate and teeth. Yeah, that's what it is. Teeth. Can I read this? No, that's just background shit. Okay. Well, I got the ID card. Will you save your... Oh, I can save here. Nice. Okay. So, I acquired the ID card, which I needed for... What did I need it for? For the, um, the elevator, I think. So, I guess we can do that now? Maybe I can uh, go through here and get there, maybe? Question mark? There's blood on the wall. This takes me to what? I can, if only I could read this. I would be able to know where I'm going. I'm gonna. I'm gonna assume that says one F. Control room hall. Huh. That's just the music. <laughs> oh, I know where I am. Okay. So we, if we would have gone with the other guy, we could have just uh. No, I need to modify it, right? Okay, uh, I have to go to which room? Ah, fuck, where was it? Um, trying to remember what room I have to go into to modify the ID card. Can I talk to you guys? What? Oh, I don't see any signs of Doc here. All right, thanks for the info. I couldn't hear what you said, but I'm pretty sure it was something very important. Um, I have to go over there to where the door is shining. I think. Yeah, because I have the um, the card that has the L on it now, so I can go, I can go there and open that up. So it's gonna take me to the safe room, and then I turn left, and there's the door. Okay. Do -do 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 -do. Do -do 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 -do. No dinosaurs, please. I'd really appreciate it. Okay, <laughs> nothing here. Management office. This is where the safe room is, and you can just go straight. No, I don't want to save. It was a joke. Well, not a joke, but a bu button press that I didn't mean to input. So here. Oh, fuck me. Hello, sir. <laughs> Excuse me while I try to open this door. Don't mind me. Mr. Raptor. I wonder if I can come in here and beat me up. You got the DDK code for disk E. Okay, I don't have the other part of disk E right now. So we're just gonna have to go with what I got. These machines are controlling the various tactical simulations program. Can I do something with this? The terminal keeps track of the soldiers who are positioned in facility. Okay, cool. And what is this? Like a like a game console? You got the FC device. 
When an ID card is created, this device is used to input the identification data. Okay. Use. I, I don't know how to use it. I guess I'll figure it out later. Oh, a plug. Nice. I will take the plug and I will use it wherever I can. You can store ammo and medical supplies in this emergency box. You need a plug to open this box. Uh, sure. Um, there are slag bullets, resuscitations. No, 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 okay. Yeah, big box for my butt plugs. Yes. <laughs> Can I store that? And then take it out and maybe combine them with that one? No? That's not how it works? Alright, sorry. Um... Maybe I can leave... This one. The Medpack S++. I... Didn't quite like it when I was using it, so... I'm just gonna leave it behind. God damn it! Um... So I have one slot open. Shotgun bullets. Medpack M. Kills an enemy in a single shot. The poison dart. Hmm. Do I really need these many health packs? Nah. I'm extremely good at video games. I don't need that many. The slag bullets though, that sounds kind of nice. And I have very little space left, so... <laughs> I have to kind of... Make do with what I can carry right now. Stops the bleeding, but will not recover your health. Maybe I should take... The hemostat. Uh... Am I gonna come back here though? I feel like I can come back here later and just move some shit around. What is this? Data file for an operating me. Will you read the file? Sure. Subject. Reinforcement of ID management. Earlier in the week, there was a case in which someone used the terminal that rewrites the ID cards to gain unauthorized, unauthorized access. This person acquired the fingerprint data from the corpses of a staff member who had died in the accident. He forged the dead man's ID by using the fingerprint data and entered the laboratory area by a way of elevator. The problem is that the fingerprint collecting device can acquire usable fingerprint data even from a corpse. Since we will be having an experiment today, there will be many outsiders visiting this facility. When creating the ID card for the guests, keep a careful eye on the device. Well, it's in my hands now, so not very careful, eh, mates? So where do I go now? Doesn't really say. I just have to kind of find a dead body, I guess. <laughs> a dead body with fingers. Shit, there's a dinosaur here. I go in here real quick. Toilet, right? This is the toilet room. <laughs> I don't have to be in the toilet. I mean, there's a vent, but that's about it. Maybe I can use the dead body and. Hey, what's up, bro? Oh, yeah, just growl at me, why don't you, idiot? Stupid dinosaur. Maybe I can use the dead body here in this room. Or something. Hello, sir. He has been gouged in the torso. He's probably fine. Um, can I do this? Fingerprint data has been collected. Okay. So what? What do I do with it then? Fingerprint data. There is data stored in the fingerprint collecting device. Overwrite the data. I, uh? Am I really ha gonna have to figure out which fucking finger I need? 
Uh, sure. Okay, let me remember which bodies I've seen. Where have I seen dead bodies? Is this the only place? I saw the guy near the medical room, but he had no arms. Tom is also there, but I'm not sure if Tom is needed. Where are there more bodies? Is, is this the only one that I remember? Ah, uh, fuck. I'm trying to remember. Mm. I think we are good. I just have to make my ID card. And to do that, I have to go to 2F, I think. No, I have to go... Fuck, where was it? Down here... What was the elevator room that I have gone, in, gone into before, I think? <sighs> Fuck. If only I could make, like, little... Little stamps. I think the room I want to go is on the right side. Yeah. Yes, I think it's gonna be on the right side. So we go over here, right? Yes. Well, uh, sure, I'll save my progress. Why not? But I think this is the right way that I have to go through. Save complete, thank you. Then I turn right here instantly to the right and walk up. So the dinosaur doesn't get me. <laughs> and then I go into the room back here, I think. Yeah, sure, let's go through here. <laughs> Elevator hall. I think we're in the right place. Oh, there's also this body right here. Do you have hands? Wait, I can move this? What in the heck? I, well, okay, thanks. I guess I can move that. I didn't know that. I, I walked to it by accident. Okay, this body has no hands. Okay, he has one hand? He has one hand, <laughs> that's for sure. Research ideas needed for that. Well, that guy has one hand. So that's better than no hands. Maybe I can use that guy. I don't know. Oh Christ, there's a dinosaur here. I think this is a place where I can make my ID cards. I think. On this machine right here, on this computer thing, a thing of a jig. A device that can write the data of an ID card. The staff assigned to the first floor, second, and. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Yes, I have an ID card. How, how do? Do I just put it in here? Initiating card data rewriting sequence. Enter the personal registration number. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, mama? Registration numbers? Oh, well, fuck me, dude. Am I gonna have to go find all those papers? Is there no log on me? Oh, Christ. Well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> Do you say something? Uh, blah, 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 nothing. Oh, this is gonna be really not fun. 
Paul Baker. Page number one, one, two, three. Section third energy study room registration. This is for Paul Baker. Fifty eight ten four. This is for Paul Baker. Fifty eight ten four. Whose ID card do I have? It doesn't say. <laughs> Colonel. Well, fifty eight ten four is is the number. 58104 Please enter the fingerprint data. Please enter the fingerprint. Is this correct? No. Well, I guess I gotta go try that other dead body. <laughs> God damn it. I gotta get the right body. I gotta get the right numbers. Oh my gosh. So I go this way, I guess. I guess Paul Baker was not the guy in that other room. So there's a dead body right here. I guess I can check this one. Where else is there dead bodies that can have maybe fingerprints I can snatch out? Let's see. There's data stored in the fingerprint device. Yeah, override it. Okay. Let's test this guy. Are you Paul Baker? Are you the correct one I need? If not, this is gonna take me a while to run around the facility and finding where these bodies are. Like, damn, dude. What was the number again? 58 something, 4? 58, 10, 4. Alright, let's try again. Uh, 58, 10, 4. Yeah, sure, enter the fingerprint data. Is this the right one? Okay, it did something. Section, stabilizer, experiment room. ID, researcher. Paul Baker. Hey, what up, Gonza Tupac? Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the stream. Hopefully, you're doing good. Will you rewrite the card? Sure. How's everything going, Gonza? Or should I call you Tupac? Hmm. Very interesting. I don't know what to call you, but I will call you Gonza. That seems fine to me. The card has been rewritten. Okay. So, what can I do with this card? You're from Argentina. Wow, that's actually not a place I expect people to really be chatting from when it comes to my chat, at least. Well, because ma mainly the people that uh, talk here are from like the US. So, Argentina, that's kind of cool. Well, hopefully things are all nice and well over there where you're at. Hopefully the pandemic stuff hasn't isn't uh, hitting Argentina too bad I, I I don't keep up with news from there so I, I can't really say myself but hopefully things are all good uh, what did I get oh I got the key all right, right right now I can use the the key to go into this elevator things are going going real good I am gentle well I appreciate that I try my best. Sometimes. At least 50% of the time, I try my best. <laughs> that was one of those 50, I suppose. Is there gonna be a dinosaur? Oh yeah! That's a dinosaur. Well, hopefully I'm not in danger. Oh, I'm definitely in danger. <laughs> Get off of me, idiot. <laughs> That is definitely a dinosaur. Uh, let's equip this. Hey, what up, Pinta? Get out of here. Get out of here, dinosaur. Is 
Is it dead? I think it is. Well, it's not dead. It's probably just taking a nap. Yeah, it's my first time playing Dino Crisis. I I've only ever seen my brother play it when I was younger. Like, way back in, like, 2000 or, or 2001. That was a long time ago, obviously. That was at least 20 years ago. A hemostat. Oh, I don't need the hemostat. So, I don't really know too much about it. I was really scared of playing these sort of games when I was younger. Because dinosaurs and stuff like that is scary. It's, it, it can get a little scary if you have them, like, swarm you and stuff like that. A file titled Security Manual Volume 1. Will you read the file? Yes. DDK, the electronic lock system of this facility, has been updated. A more intricate code system has been introduced and the security level has has been improved. You will need to be aware of the following information when entering the password. Yeah, uh, whenever... It's it's when I first... Uh, around the first time that I came to the US when uh When I first saw my brother play this game. I never saw him beat it. I think he did. And I don't really remember much about it other than... There's a T-Rex and it, it, it bites you <laughs> and that's it. I don't really too much. I don't, I don't know too much about it anymore. I'm just kind of running around and figuring it out on like, as I go, of course. Number based key decoding part one in a case where numbers are written instead of the letters in the key field, the numbers could represent the codes for the corresponding characters. So if it was like a, it would be one, two, B, three, C. Hey, no problem, dude. Uh, the the main language in Argentina is Spanish, right? I I know how to speak Spanish too. If you're more comfortable with it, unless you really want to practice your English, uh, either or is perfectly fine for me. Cause I think the main language is Spanish in Argentina. I'm not actually too sure anymore. I've never been there myself, so so I'm not I'm not like as familiar. Okay, the number is going to end. Okay, I read that. Here's an example of correspondent charts between the letters and the code. Okay, yeah, that's what I, that's what I was saying. A1, B2, C3. Mm-hmm-hmm. <laughs> wow. Very easy to remember stuff. I cannot press this, right? Well, you press the switch. Nothing happened. Okay. I mean, I, I can press it. Something happening is another thing, though. Ooh, can I take this map? The map of the B1. Yes, I will take the map data. Beautiful. How are things over there in Argentina? Uh, are things like pretty normal? Like when it comes to how how the world um, reacted to the whole pandemic there? It has been locked with digital disk key which which one am I missing which one do I need the L one okay I have the L one okay so three I need to not use C so the password is L F A Skip the C. Skip the C. Am I putting the? <laughs> Am I putting the right password? L. <laughs> Could be D is no good. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. Okay, everything from C to H is no buenos. No good. Ah, uh, okay. Well, hopefully things don't get too bad over there. I know things here in the, in the U.S. are starting to calm down a little bit. But, I mean, it could always get worse like 
out of nowhere for all we know so hopefully things just start start going like you know not as bad all oh, right the f2 ah oh, right 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 c d e f g h yeah yeah my bad let's just start over so l oh that's why it didn't make sense because i put lf lab i'm gonna guess no it's not lab it's lab La, la, yo, it's lab. Laboratory, I think. Labo. Labora. Three. There we go. Nice. Easy. First try. Didn't even struggle. Just a little bit of awkwardness by me. But that's just me being me. TBH. Hello? Is there any dinosaurs? Oh, there's a thing here. There doesn't seem to be a dinosaur. At least not right away. Oh, why did I have to open my mouth? <laughs> no, there's two of them. Right in front of the freaking door. Why do I do this to myself every time? Holy crap. Run! Oh no! <laughs> yes, push the switch. Can I go in here? Okay, yes I can. Oh my gosh. That's literally a very, like a very common thing that happens here. I say something and I have instant karma. It's, I don't know why, I don't know how I do it, but huh, I wish I could stop it. It's just like, oof. <laughs> it's like I have, if I have like a power of sorts, a stand power like they have in the, that Jojo's anime. Ooh, a box. You got the screwdriver, especially sharp, Especially shaped screwdriver that is used for computer maintenance. Cool. Well, I have a screwdriver now. That's kind of cool. All right, I have this thing that I picked up and aid. What is this again? An aesthetic. An aesthetic aid. Um, I will mix it with this, maybe. You know what? Sure, give me this. Why not? It gives me one more slot. And having one more one more slot is always handy. Warning, do not touch this panel unless the lock system malfunctions. The circuits inside this panel supply the electric power needed for the force release of the lock. Okay. What is this on the floor? Oh, another plug. Nice. Yeah, and, and I, I figured you can make darts. I have a few already that I made. Well, when I say few, I mean I made one and then have never used them. <laughs> but I have it. That's that's for sure. Well, let's see. Oh, there's a safe one here. I don't even know. I'm not actually sure of all the things you can make or all the possible combinations. Because uh, I don't know the game too well. Because it's a game from 1999. <laughs> so. I hear noises. <laughs> it's not like something that I played. Really when I was growing up myself. So. Oh I can go around the dinosaurs here. But there's also more dinosaurs here. Great. But there was something else in this room I didn't read. There was a piece of paper on a, on a table I think. That I could read here. I think it was right here. Yeah, yeah. E, e, come on. E. There we go. That's not the thing I wanted to do. Experimental area control programming running. Auto lock status on. Will you release the lock? Sure. Enter the area number to be. Oh, I have no idea. 
This site is dangerous. <laughs> That's fantastic. That's what I want to hear. Uh, I'm I'm not very good with uh these sort of games, like the Resident Evil kind of games, like classic Resident Evil. I'm good with like RE2 remake because that game is more like RE4, which I was pretty decent at RE4, but when it comes to these, I'm a little bit worse because I'm not very very good at them or I didn't play them very much when I was growing up because obviously I I was young babby boy whenever these games came out a file titled security manual volume 2 will you read it sure DDK the electronic lock system of this facility has been updated again a more intricate code system has been introduced which improves the level of security, you will need to be aware of the following information when entering the password. Number base key code, the part two. In a case where numbers are written instead of letter in the key field, the numbers could indicate the columns to be deleted. What? For example, if two is in the key word, you should delete all the letters from the second column. Oh, okay. Okay, I get it. Yeah, I like the, the feel that they have, like from those old Resident Evil games. Like, um, at least the English version of Resident Evil 1 <laughs> has always been something that stood out to me. Because the game is good, but the voice acting is, um, how do I say it? Not very good. But that makes it fun. <laughs> it makes it very fun. Just to like watch or, or play or anything like that. What am I missing? Um, ID card, if you see this, whatever, blah, blah, blah. No, be used here. Okay. I don't know if there was a, a Spanish dub of the game. I don't think there was from what I remember. But... Yeah, it's always been like that. Yeah, sure, I'll remove the screws. Why not? I don't have to operate this with this right now. Okay, sorry. Oh, that's not the door. The door's over here. Right. We, uh, I don't have to sit. Wait, there was actually a Spanish version for, um, like, with Spanish voices and everything on the PS1? Really? That's the first time I hear that. Myself, at least. Oh, Christ. Where are you, Mr. Dinosaur? Oh, just subtitles. Okay, I thought it would be like a full dub. I'm g ah! <laughs> I'm gonna assume the game was still like in English or something. You almost became a Jill sandwich! <laughs> Stupid as a uh, line from the game. Oh, there's a dinosaur in here. Hello? Where are you? I know you're here. Or did I just hear things? I probably just heard things. There's probably nothing. I think I'm fine. Or what the hell did I hear? I heard like a... Like, dinosaur feet. Adding another gas to one with a poison level under 30 may neutralize the gas. Uh. Oh, wait, what? Red gas neutralizes the poison in the green gas. Okay, red beats. Okay, it's like Pokemon. Fire beats grass. Got it. Blue grass neutralizes the poison in orange. Okay. So, kind of, water beats fire, kind of, I guess. And green neutralizes the poison from... Okay, this one doesn't make any sense anymore. But I'm... Because <laughs> uh, in Pokemon, poison, the which is the purple type, is strong against the green, which is grass type. But I, I'm going to pretty much associate them like that. Remember these rules when mixing the gases. You got it, boss. I will keep that in mind. I'll I'll, I'll think if I'll, I'll think of Pokemon. Looks like a research journal. Will you read the journal? Sure. March third energy. 
It is a system that can produce infinite energy from the air. The completion of this system will signify the end of one society. Reading is hard. The completion of this system will signify the end of one of society's greatest problems. It is true that the system was initially developed for military use, but we took part in the project because there is a silver lining in it for our future. But something is terribly wrong. The military has been giving us excessively favorable treatment for the simple development of a fundamental energy system. I must discover the true purpose of this project before irreparable harm is done. What on earth is that kid planning to do? April. I haven't found any clues in the past month. He is indeed a genius. He seems to have noticed our secret investigation activities. I heard that he established a secret lab on the on this floor somewhere. The only way to learn of his true intentions will be to find the lab. July. At long last, Mike has found a clue pertaining to the location of the secret laboratory. He said that he hid the clue in our secret place inside the library room. Ah. Kirk has been meeting frequently with Colonel Clay, the leader of the project in the computer room lately. What are they up to? Who knows? Probably something. This computer terminal controls the condition of the experimental room remotely. Something is shown in the display. Lock code 7248. I will remember that. 7248. I'm going to assume that's for the... Uh, for the other computer over here. 7248. 7248. Do not forget the code. 7248. 7248. This way. Thank you for writing it because I, knowing me, I'll forget. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna guess. I go here, I put the code in, and then I can mess around with that little panel. Right there. 7248. Yes. 7248. There we go. The number has been confirmed. The gas experiment room lock has been released. Okay. So that's the room that I was in before. I'm gonna say. So can I mess with this now? No wonder. I don't have. Okay, and I, I don't have to do anything. Sure, I'll save my progress. Have you ever played the Silent Hill games, uh, Gonza? At least the ones on, well, the one on PlayStation 1. Because those are kind of similar to uh, Resident Evil, kind of, I guess. Well, the first one more than anything. I guess the second one and the third feel pretty Resident Evil-ish, too. Now that I'm thinking about it. Silent Hill. The the games with the, the silent and the hill. <laughs> those. For the PlayStation and PlayStation 2, there's more, of course, but those are the, the main ones people like. Silent Hill 1 to 3. Which is the ones I've played on stream, actually. 1, 2, and 3, with uh, 4 maybe at some point down the line. Oh, I did this already. Oh, you've never played it. Oh, I see, I see. They're they're pretty similar, I guess you could say. I guess Silent Hill is more open when it comes to like an open... Is that person alive? Like an open world, I guess? The chamber is filled with poisonous gas and the door has been automatically locked. Well, time to remember the things that I learned about Pokemon. Let's see. There are three buttons. They are used to supply the gas to the gas chamber. Okay, so it's a little bit orange. So against orange, you need blue. And against... I think I did it wrong. <laughs> right, not that one. 
<laughs> just making the. Uh, let me start over. Hold on, sir. I will save you. Do not worry. <laughs> there you go, sir. Uh. Okay, it's greenish. So you do that. It's gonna turn orange. So you give it some blue. And we're good. There we go. I just have to remember the colors and the Pokemon pertaining to it. Yeah, they're very popular games. At least the first few. Uh, it got a little weird after, of course. Gonna be okay. what happened? Sorry if the voices are low. The game doesn't have good voice mixing. Hmm. Where is Dr. Kirk? Yes, where's Dr. Kirk? I need to know. He said it'll give me access to something. I didn't quite understand what he said. The numbers 36, 95 are handwritten on it. Okay. Well, he's fucking dead. Oh, he has another key on him. Okay, nice. The words emergency case. Oh, this is for the, the little the little boxes that were... Where was it that I saw the little box that I could open? I think it was in the safe room. The safe room with... I forgot. I'll remember as I go along. Oh, this is your favorite game? Really? Dino Crisis? Whoa. Ah. Yeah. I could see that. TBH. Dino Crisis has always been like that game that always interested me. Because uh, if it's, it's pretty much like Resident Evil, obviously. But... Uh -uh. That actually kind of scared me. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. That kind of freaked me out. Alright, you stupid dinosaur. Get some green in you. Yeah, idiot. That's what you get for messing with me. Which button will you press? Huh? I think that's good enough. <laughs> Dumbass. I forgot what I was even talking about because I got freaked out. I guess it doesn't it doesn't matter. <laughs> um where do I have to go from here? Let's see. I am right here in this room. And there's another big room I haven't been into because I'm afraid. Hey, thanks for the follow, Gonza. I appreciate it, bro. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hopefully you enjoy your stay. I will be trying to play Dino Crisis 2 at some point as well, as well as uh, Silent Hill 4. And, what you know, whatever comes my way. I know for sure this Friday I'll be playing Monster Hunter Rise. So if you enjoy Monster Hunter, come on by. Because it's going to be a Monster Hunter day. Uh, where am I gonna go now? I don't know. I'm just gonna walk out outside and see what happens. I feel like there was uh, dinosaurs here and there's a laser door. Oh, there is. Okay. <laughs> Idiot. And this is a health thing. I can put in a plug. I need two plugs for it. I don't have enough. I have one plug. So this leads down into that entrance over there what that place has I have no idea but I can find out I just have to wait for the dinosaur to do that again and then I activate then I run through because when it's on the floor he can't beat my ass nice oh 
The library room. This is the the place where they were talking in the Did I hear a dinosaur or am I imagining? Will you take the med sure I'll take the med pack. But have you played Dino Crisis 3? Now that's a game I'm very curious if you've played. Hey, thanks for the host, Gonzo. <laughs> I appreciate it. I was wondering what that sound was. A critical hit with will inflict tremendous damage. I can't even say how do I use this? Oh, I'm now it's pretty much all rigged out. My my gun. Oh, nice. Uh, what am I supposed to do here? I wasn't actually... Uh, there's something around here that I'm supposed to do from what I remember. A terminal to manage the information of the key chips that are used to open the data storage. You can input the data to a key chip and research and search the data storage from here. Oh, fuck. Not again. I didn't mean to read it again. Okay. Uh, each. Let's see what does it say. Oh, you've never played Dino Crisis Three, well It had a number. I already forgot it. <laughs> uh, let me check what the number was again. Wrong machine. Check. I am using the wrong thing. Thirty-six ninety-five. Okay. Thir <laughs> I keep doing this. Thirty-six ninety-five. Yes. Thirty-six ninety-five. There we go. The number has been confirmed, displaying the magnetic pattern. Data for the storage. Thirty-six ninety-five. Please overwrite the magnetic pattern of the key chip correctly. So I have to make Okay. So there has to be a little gap right there. There has to be a two here and a one. Uh, there we go. I'm so good at video games. What the heck? I'm literally a genius. My IQ is astro astronomically high right now. I'm quite literally the best player in this game, honestly. <laughs> Not really, but I, I did that. I did that. <laughs> All right. Hey, the I would have figured out the pipes eventually, okay? I never said I was the fastest. I just said I'm the best. Um, right here. All that uh, the key chip for the correct, yep. The pipes, the one from the um, from that section underground. Where you have to put the red, the blue, and the green pipes connected, and then it powers up a generator, so you can make a a giant lift uh, function, or a giant elevator, I should say. Real? What does this do? The letter R is carved into the card. Key card R. What do I do with keycard R? I have L and now I have R. Okay. A memo is in the data storage. Will you read the memo? Sure. Dear Paul, I finally found the clue. This is the keycard that you need to enter a secret lab. The only chance to enter... The only chance to enter it is during tonight's experiment. Obtain the other key card without hesitation. The other key card is in the chief's room. 
I heard the secret codes for the hidden safe are written in the panel key. Now, if we find out where the laboratory is, everything will be solved. I'll leave that to you. Good luck. Okay. So, I'm going to assume these key cards. Because I think in the room where the... Where? What was it again? That that said something about putting keys on a wall or something. I think I read something like that while I was going through this. Um. Oh, hello, mate. Don't mind me. Okay. <laughs> was it this room? Was it this room that had the the thing? Research meeting room. I think here there was two slots that I can mess around with. I could be wrong. What is this? Can I use that? I think I was wrong about the room. Very wrong. Okay. <laughs> I think it's the room with the computer that had the... Um, the, 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 the the slots for the key cards. I think this room. But yeah, I'm surprised you have never beat uh, Dino Crisis 2, honestly. I feel like you might have since it's on PS1. I, I can understand why you probably have never played Dino Crisis 3 because. Uh, wait, what? Because that game is on, I think it's on Xbox, and it's a little bit, um, a little bit weird. Just a little bit weird in comparison to the rest. You will need assistance in order to release this slot. Will you call Gale? Sure, I'll call Gale. Which, I finally made it to the entrance of the doctor's lab. which one's Gale? The blonde guy? The door looks like it needs two people working in tandem to unlock it. Hmm. Thank you, Gale. Now I sit here and wait. So, what's our status? Everything's okay, fine. Take this. Ready? Yes, sir. Okay, on three. One, two, two, three. Okay, I thought I would have to press the thing myself. Hope I'm glad I'm not because I'm very bad <laughs> with coordination. So thank goodness I didn't have to do anything. I would have messed it up. Several times. I'll have to do the DDK now too. E. Well, you set the DDK, okay. The the third burden nef ball on Hiro is guessy. That's what I'm saying. So I wonder if this time I have to do the columns. Ah, uh, okay, I see, I see. That makes sense. I mean, I, I'm playing these right now on PS3 through a uh, backwards compatibility, so I I can I can play either or whenever I really need to, of course. And I will play Dino Crisis 2 at some point. Hey, what up, Myrna? The password is that the password? Is that what it is? I'm gonna input that. I'm gonna put that in, Myrna. The I can't I I can't make spaces. The password. I will I will humor you. And write the password and even though I know it's not right. Okay, it doesn't even fit. <laughs> I will humor you though. How are you though, Myrna? Okay, so I had read a thing that said columns one, two, three, four, five. So everything in the this whole things are gone. So this three, these two. Sorry if you can't hear me very well right now. Um, pointing at the screen. So I'm going to say E and uh, 
Oh, the password's energy. Energy. No, not energ. Energy. No, delete that one. There we go. Oh, you played it on your PC. Ah, I see, I see. That makes sense. Uh, I've never seen anything about the second one, so I'm not actually too sure how different it is. Will you save your progress up to this point? Yes, sir. I will save my progress. And with that, it will be the end of today's stream. Because I usually stream at least two hours a day. So it's been an hour and 54. So that's, that's at least two hours. So this is where we're going to end today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's stream. It was fun. I got through... A lot more than I expected to get through because I, I think I'm getting a little bit more accustomed to the movement and just like the, the, the loop, the gameplay loop of the game and dodging the dinosaurs and stuff like that. So it was fun. Uh, I'll be back tomorrow around the same time, 8.30 p.m. Pacific time or 9.30 p.m. Pacific time. Th those are my usual times when I stream. Uh, you can convert the time to your time zone if really needed so you can figure out what time uh, I go live or you can join my discord it's at the bottom of the of the of the stream or you can type exclamation mark discord and I'll give you a link I usually type or uh, give announcements every time I go live so yeah oh it's 2 25 in Argentina right now wow that's a lot later than here right now it's uh 10 25 p.m. here in the United States but yeah, that's going to be it for me today. Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. It was fun. Tomorrow more Dino Crisis. We'll see how far we can get. Maybe by Thursday we'll beat the game. I'm not sure. I hope it's by Thursday because today is Tuesday already. So by Thursday I want to be I want to be done with this game already. And yeah, it was nice to meet you as well, Gonza. Hopefully you have a good night. Hopefully everyone has a good night and uh hopefully you all stay safe during this whole things that are going on in the world of course so thank you for watching i appreciate you and uh yeah have a good night and i'll see you tomorrow for more dino crisis at the same time as usual so yeah have a good one bye 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 bye